Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mokalover and thank you for joining me here in Old World Blues, but this isn't where we left off yesterday, so between this episode and the last, there must have been an update where I could not play the last saved game again. The game would continue crashing, so I basically restarted and tried to get to the same point where we left off last time, but as you can tell, didn't work out that way. So right now we are, we are at war with the Troll Warren, so let me catch up. So we're the Thrads Legion again, of course. I'm trying to do Golgotha Restoration. And I tried to ally the Troll Warren, but they said no. I was like, okay, no biggie. I'll still help you kill off the Bone Dancers, which we did. But then they're like, nah. So now they want the t all that territory. So now we're at war. Other than that, uh, let's see. We technically, now in this game, or this campaign, go to war with Klamath. All of Klamath, because Arroyo did not take any of Klamath earlier. So, they are next, and we haven't defeated the 80s yet. It is unfortunate that it had to be like this. Regardless, let us go ahead and have a good time with the Troll Warren. Troll Warren seems to be very, very weak. Like, yeah, they have, like, no manpower. They got 24 31 divisions. They were slowly getting beaten back by the Bone Dancers until I got involved. So, yeah, and all my guys are pretty much all Super Mutants. And this is the division that I'm currently using. 20 combat with. Very nice. Uh, I need to put cam companies on these guys too. Pulse explosives. Very good. Grenade rifles. So, I do apologize. It is only 2279. I think at the end of yesterday's video we were at like... Ooh... 2281 maybe? So, this is definitely not where we left off yesterday. It's unfortunate. It's really unfortunate. I really wish that uh, the save games worked. Always. But, you know what, the real reason that happened, probably because there's an update, and I left my Steam account on online mode, not offline mode, which I usually keep it on, so it just auto-updates, which sucks. It really does. Cool. Uh, regardless, let's go ahead and take down the den so we can go to war with them whenever we want. So, the people of Klamath are, after all, quite primitive, and their town might be better served under others' rule. It would be a great asset for Nurina to acquire after all. Cool. And I did ask you guys yesterday, what would be a good name for the Intelligence Agency? Well, we went with Masters Elite Nightkins. Because, you know, oh, NCR is having some Civil War problems. Very good, very good. So, of course, we have to be the Masters. All over the Masters. And so, they, you guys recommended that I use the term Nightkins, or, you know, the Warriors Nightkins, uh, in that. So, I figured, you know what, why don't we just call their Intelligence Agency Men? They would no one would ever guess that that would be our name. So, I figured why not. Very good, very good. So far, we're winning pretty well. We've lost 300 versus 4,000. Yeah, I don't know what's up with the Troll Warren. They're just very, very weak. And I think we did see that I had a lot more manpower when we started this. Hmm. I still don't have enough. Oh, actually, I have quite a bit of infantry armor. I haven't used any of it yet, though, really. Yeah, that's a lot for the Bone Dancers. Holy cow. Put them on riders, put them on riders. That might be too much. Yeah, but that does help save a little bit on infantry equipment. Eh, that's kind of okay. War and operative captured. I like the your hat, man. I like your hat. Yeah, we're gonna need a, little, need a little bit more manpower. Whoa, buddy. Has to be 2280. We gotta wait a few more months because we are really running out of manpower. Are we mobilizing? No, we're not. Hmm. Taking down the den. That'd be nice. So then we can get some free cores because I could really use more manpower. If that's the case, capture the war. Very good. Let me go ahead and get rid of these, so we can save on manpower just a little bit, because we're doing pretty well. I would like to maximize our Air Force, or, you know, really, really bring it out, make it real nice and such. But at this point, the biggest thing that's killing us isn't the enemy army, I think. It's most likely just resistance. And that's why I chose to get that one Golgotha reservation, so we get way less resistance for what's for all this territory that we haven't cored yet. Which really sucks. Really, really sucks. Outsider battalions. We might go with outsider battalions. Yeah. We get 15% more non core manpower. You know what? We'll do that. Why not? There you go. It gave us a flat low 2300, which was immediately spent, but that's okay. Come to Culp Creek. So, you probably didn't expect that in this episode we'd be taking out the Troll Worm. We were allied with them last episode. This is very true. Very, very true. Well, let's get some more manpower. Large-scale slavery. The savages of the Antelope tribe are worthless almost except as potential slaves. Capturing the remnants of the tribe and putting them to work, even as personal bodyguards, is sure to have a great benefit. I know I read that one yesterday, but, you know, it is what it is. Cool. Well, I don't think we can really go to war anymore unless we puppet somebody. 
But I'm not the type of guy who really loves puppeting stuff. Except that we go to War of Clowns next. And put a smile on our face as we do it. Well, at least we're pretty big. And we do reach the ocean. O ocean. Not ocean. Ocean. We shouldn't have a super difficult time fighting these guys. But I could be wrong about that. Could be very wrong. Focus fire would be nice since I haven't even killed off the 80s yet in this campaign. I'm gonna get LMGs once again. Purchase slaves. Yes, please. We only have a thousand. Oh, I guess we were maxed out already. That sucks. Uh, could use more slaves, please. Thank you. Mm, could use more military factories. We are lacking this stuff, which is actually pretty important. Uh, let's see. Go down to two for now. Do that. Put you at the bottom because we definitely need more. Uh, definitely need more factories. Ooh, oh my goodness. Some rapid prototyping. That'd be nice. Are we good to go? I believe we are. Oh, uh, they're, uh, they're guaranteed by a royal, which is over there, so we can't even touch them yet. That's fine for now. And, I guess they probably took the 20% stability hit. Probably. Which is good. Guaranteed the independence of Thrad's Legion and Klamath. Well, they didn't do that one very well, now did they? But, well, I don't remember guaranteeing them. I really don't remember guaranteeing a royal. But okay. NCR is looking really bad. That's really nice to see. Ah, uh, the Dayglow. What? I've never played as a Dayglow yet. Then again, this is not Sweet Home California, which is another mod for Old World Blues. A very, very good mod, of course, for Old World, old world Blues. Thank you very much. Does the Royal want to go to war with me now? Maybe? So we're not at war with the Western Brotherhood, obviously. These guys, we're going to have to fight them off eventually. Um, let's put you off for now. Good. Good. Nice. Get the next book is done so we can get some free cores on Klamath territory. And then we get 500. Oh, look at that. A royal declare one of the apostles. Very cool. Whoever wins, I'm going to kill off anyway, so it doesn't really even matter. Miniaturized circuitry. Very good. Very good. And let's do that one. And then let us do that one. Cool. Anything else here, really? I mean, we're pretty much maxed out already on. Um slaves, which is really disappointing, but whatever, you know. Oh, wait, uh, enslaving the war, and huh? We still need to do that for the master, but let us do take the township with our power over Klamath consolidated. We can claim the town as our rightful territory and work on bringing it under direct rule from Nuino. Absolutely. Our looks like Royal's probably winning, so I'm gonna go ahead and maybe oh, no, no, no. They're guaranteed. Come on, apostles. Land of Coral. Oh, I still need to play as this group. I really do. Ooh, loudspeakers are like that. That seems kind of loud, though. That's okay. Oh, they're slowly winning. I don't want to just fight on them yet, just because I don't want to give them the idea that I am going to wallop them later on. So, we're not going to do that yet. What are we lacking? We're lacking fire teams. We're lacking anti-tank. Infantry armor's coming back. We're lacking close air support. Uh, oh, I can't switch that one out. We could probably... Eh, it's not really worth switching that one out yet. But that's okay. We'll keep it on anyways. How many doggos do we have? Not enough. Ugh. Come on, guys. Kill each other. Kill each other. Now, we have to deal with the Washington Brothers ourselves. They apparently took out the old country as well. The White Legs are looking pretty thick. Uh, New Vegas. The Dam Busters are fighting the Legion. The NCR is just looking... Hello. Um, that, that seems a little sudden that they went to war with us, but okay. Let's grab that. Well then. Um, hmm. I definitely was not expecting this. But okay. That is really just going to seal your fate now, ain't it? Go ahead and head on over there. We must start just to these guys, because we're definitely going to kill uh, Arroyo first. We're being the nincompoops that they are. Oh, yeah. Smash them. Oh, go there goes the damn busters. Yeah, apostles. Yeah, give me that. I'll take, all, I'll take all sorts of stuff that you got, guys. I'll gladly take it all. Hey, more military factories. Very, very nice, my friends. Don't do that. That's good. Nice, these guys are cut off, and they're going to go bye-bye. It seems like we are doing all the work against Arroyo, which is okay. 
I'm okay with me. Uh, let's grab that. Let's grab that. I want as much stability as possible, because stability is so good. Taking the township? Nice, my friend. Very nice. Uh, let's see. It's saving the Warren. So, well, while the first would not kneel to us willingly, but he and his people will kneel to us when they are weighed down by chains. Yes. Which does nothing, but we'll see what happens. I really wish we could get more than a thousand slaves. I mean, sure, we get a thousand four, but it resets and goes lower to a thousand every single time. I wish we could get more slaves and make them do even more. Like, I know we really shouldn't too much promote slavery and stuff, but, uh, <clears throat> they're they're useful for reasons, you know. They have uses. They definitely have uses. So, yeah. Too bad you can't like force them to like help build things faster, like infrastructure. That'd be kind of cool. Maybe radar stations. That'd be kind of cool. If they could. Let's go ahead and grab some better doggos. Even though I'm not even using them yet. And we have another division made. I think. Yes, we do. Cool. Oh boy. Oh. Oh no. Um, now this. You saw me struggle once against the 80s. I guess you're gonna watch me struggle again. Why not? Crackpot the Servant. Finesse. Basically promoted. Strong attack. In oh, enduring. Usually, I don't think we usually get enduring. That's kind of cool. Now he's a field marshal, so that's good. And no. Experience soldiers' losses. Um, just go ahead and do. I mean, this one's recovery rates are really good if you're in many battles often. Head on over there quickly. All right, you guys are just moving too slow. Go, 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 go. Kick it up a notch. Uh, the 80s are a pain in the booty. Do we have enough empty tank? We don't. That's really not good. Um, do that. Screw the LMGs. What we need is empty tank right now. Come on, kill them, kill them, kill them, kill them. They want to. They literally went to war with us. I didn't want war with them. Well, I kind of did, but we don't need to tell the public that. Come on, get in there, get in there, get in there, get in there. Oh my god, please, please, come on. Okay, white legs, crazy horns, cool. Great. Alright, so, you know what, I'll be nice. There you go, fossils. Good. Now, rush to the line. Rush. No general threat, what do you have for us? Robotics wouldn't make very much sense for him, so we're not going to give that to him. Better plane stuff? Uh, maybe, maybe not. Aerial warfare, that could be helpful. Hey, refined tools, better engines, cool. Get some of that. Get some more of that. We're doing pretty well. We will kill off the apostles a little later. Oh, look at that manpower. Non-core manpower is so good to have. Alright, so we're going to get destroyed. Oh my god. Yep. I'm sorry for the stuff. Oh boy. Move. Move, move, move. Oh, this is going to be a huge struggle war. Oh, this is not going to be a fun war, I can already tell. I already lost four divisions. No! Ah, oh, screw it. Just out of there. Oh, boy. You know what? Well, you know, I lost four divisions. That's just because they overran us already. Yeah, you guys will not stand up to us and when we attack. You attack immediately. Do not be on the defensive. Do whatever you can to be on the attack. We're going to lose a lot of guys, but that's okay. I already lost a thousand. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. Go extreme. Oh, we don't have enough command power to force attack. And saving the Warren. Cool, they did nothing for us. For the Master, we can wait on that. Let's go back this way and renovating Shark Club. So, the Shark Club is the largest casino in Reno, owned by Bishop Family. It's a thriving core of gambling and entertainment in a very hard of New Reno, but it could use some revitalization. I just said that one very quickly, just because I've kind of already read that before. So, uh, do we have any extra planes, maybe? Yes, please? Yes, there, you, there we go. You're definitely going to see me struggle this episode. Definitely. Make sure. Oh, we're doing a lot of damage, which is actually really good. Oh, this is going to be. Painful to watch. Oh, I'm gonna lose a lot of guys, but they've already lost a thousand as well. So, oh, that's not good. Uh, Gilbert, you got anything for us? You lost. You lost a lot of guys. I really shouldn't have used a general, but that's okay. There you go. Thrad. Thrad is a great general. Oh, we're pushing them back. Push these pieces of garbage back. Good. Crush them. Crush their bones. Enslave the weak. Unless we think they're too strong, in which we'll just make sure that they don't let them back. We hope. Good. We just saw that we overran a few enemy divisions. Um, I think I, I did go up to four-year conscription. We're doing okay for now. 
So I'm, I'm going to hold off on raising our conscription level, but I'm not going to stop attacking. Because the moment we stop attacking, they can probably push us back, so it's not worth doing that. Anti-tank, we're almost done. Western Brotherhood supports the rebel. Of course they would. Of course they would. Uh, throw on a couple more factories. One. Two. Good. Not that much more. I'm going to go to war with them, but we're not going to do that right now. Yes, good, 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 good. Energy cell game boost. They have a few thousand manpower, 64 divisions, which isn't bad. They still have more than us, but it's roughly equal, and we've been killing a lot more of them than they can kill of us. Good. Kill every single one of them off. Woo! I'm glad we got rid of that war with against the Royal really quickly. Woo! And NCR's coming back, too. Well, it looks like we're doing pretty well. Not everywhere, but... We're slowly getting our lands back and forcing them to waste their manpower on resistance stuff. Oh, yeah, point three, good. Good, we didn't even core this stuff yet. Loss is 3,000, getting close, yeah, pretty much 3,000. Gets n roughly 9,000, that's pretty good. Uh, go ahead and grab that. Did I put those on my divisions yet? Oh, I haven't. That's not good, there we go. Uh, riders. Oh, do we have enough dogs? I don't think we have enough dogs yet. Yeah, we really don't. Yeah, I think it's a Baron's Republic. Hey, yeah, NCR's back together. They must be really hurt. But oh well. Good for them. Mm, oh, let's get some better range for everyone. That's good. It's always good to get. Yeah, it's lucky we pushed them back. It's, it's so worth being on the attack. Sometimes. Renovating Shark Club. Good. Renovating the Desperado. It's another no one of Nerino's greatest casinos owned by the Mordinos. It is also the center of the drug trade of Nerino, primarily of that good old drug called J -J 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 Jet. Hey, Jesse David. Jesse David. Can I use our boxy? Yes. Bloody mess. I'm going to go with Life Giver. That could be really good for us because we've got quite a few experienced divisions by now. And eh, they're regulars, to say the least. Which is good. Very good, very good, very good. Uh, so you know what? Grab some support equipment. We could probably use that. Never mind. I mean, yes, we do need that. Holy cow. Yeah, I'm going to keep selecting that one for now. Research speed. We can be. Yeah, I get some more research speed for now. 10%. Not bad. That's better than the usual 5% that you get, but it looks like we're doing extremely well right now. Loving it. And we have on the of piloting. Good. And fuel injection and offensive armaments. I love being offensive. Hmm. Cool. Better recon. It's a little bit ahead of time, but that's okay with me. Because we need to be. Too bad I wasted political power trying to go to war with the apostles, but whatever. Alright, so they've lost 15,000. That's what they deserve. 15,000 losses. Alright, they chose... Oh, look at that stability. Holy cow. Why are they so low stability? Doom of the Wasteland? Raider Power Broker? The Devils of Utah? And at war... Oh, yeah. That's nice. 48 divisions? No. You... They, they could have. If I was playing as the 80s and the AI was Thrax Legion, I would have probably attacked just a little bit sooner, probably. Because I was distracted by Royo and the Troll Warren. Yeah... They, they had opportunity to really just blaze through with their motorized. I mean, motorized can be extremely fast. Not that I ever use it in overall blues until I play as the 80s someday, but still. Alright, next up that we really must focus on? This. Uh, actually, let's do this one first. There you go. Alright, nice. We got enough anti-tank, it looks like, hopefully. I'm going to make sure we have a, a very nice, healthy stockpile of anti-tank, just because uh, we need them. Actually, duplicate this for now. Come on. Come on. Bah. Save. Duplicate. Good. Come back to this in just a little bit. Um, there we go. Put X to work. The Mordinos have a plan to establish control over people through the, er, their addiction to the drug jet and through debt force, forcing them under their control, having them to work to pay back their debt. It's a good plan. And the reason I let time go on for now is just because it does give you, like, a few days as it goes on, so it's fine, totally fine doing that for a few days. Uh, maintenance companies, we might use them, but let's use logistics. Even though I'm not, I'm not even using them yet. Bear, I did bear because I want behemoths. I want m these massive hulking creatures. 28. Actually, how, how big are these? These guys are two combo, but these are four. What if we went like that? Organization does go up. 
I wish there was a way to tell the difference between these two. Uh, organization still stays the same. Recon actually goes down a little bit. You get more breakthrough, which is nice. A little bit... Wow, a lot more HP. Holy cow. Breakthrough goes up. It's more soft attack. Less recon. 42. If I rem remove that... Overall, it's still 5.9. Well, we could try. It doesn't have to be perfect. And these are our special forces, so... But that HP, look at that. 1800 HP? That ain't bad, man. That really ain't bad. Oh, also, I'm probably gonna switch out... Eh, get rid of that one. Place with the logistics companies, just because... Supply... They're, these guys are heavy. They use a ton of supplies. Holy cow. Go and grab that. That's fine. Alright, I don't have to pay attention to this anymore. Now, uh, I know in the last episode we were trying to core stuff to get it went over, but it is what it is. And are you guys... Yep, you're still stuck with the NCR. Huh. That is interesting. But that's okay. We'll kill them off as soon as we can go to war with... Eh, that, no, that's normal. Uh, the Legion, so... After this, we'll go probably to war with Murtal. Maybe the Apostles first. Yeah, that probably, probably would be good. Uh, so we can... So which parts of Nevada do we not have cored? Which ones do we, do we have cored? So we got this part cored over here, so it's probably worth coring... Well, we have Klamath. That's probably worth... Ooh, that has more factories, though. We're gonna do this so we can get up to the Warren. Yeah, we want to core the Warren next. Grenade rifle's very good. Let's go and do that. That's fine. Let's come over here. Grab that. How much do we need for the Warren? The Warren is definitely worth coring. Oh, yeah. A couple guys cut off. Always a side to see. A good side to see, I should say. Nice. There you go. He died. Great. Thank you for playing 80. That was actually easier than the last time we did it. I was a little worried at first just because they were moving fast. And I did lose like four divisions. But, you know, it is what it is. Since we're... Uh, let's go back over here. If they take that territory in the north, that doesn't really matter to me. I don't really care. Also, as you can see, we already have a lot of this stuff done. That's beautiful. We still have tons of manpower. We actually play this a lot more smoothly than my original take on this. Because I knew what was going to happen for the most part. Get 1.48, that's not bad. Continue fighting tactics. Well, there can only be one super mutant master of the entire wasteland, so. And I think now we probably have enough anti tank guns. Put it up to 10. We need way more support equipment now. Put you back up here, put you over here, put the attics to work. Yes, yes, yes. And. Cool, we get more infrastructure towards the north. Or the master. Let's get that just so we can do that whenever we need to. So they took our master from us. They took our future, our dreams, and our hopes. Yet they cannot take away his memory. And they cannot keep us from finishing his dreams. The wasteland shall belong to mutant kind. And under one leader, Thrad the Immortal. Or the master. Oh, and more ground attack? Yes, please. Thank you. We could really use more planes around here. Yeah, but we have no spare planes. Hmm. We really don't. Spec Ops. We don't believe in spec ops equipment. I could. Eh, I'm just going to get deleted. We can't fit in puny human spec ops armor. Are you kidding me? Of course not. Fire teams, how much infantry going do I make? I don't think I make that much. Yeah, we're still using slashing melee weaponry, which is not really modern. Um, in the meantime, go ahead and train if you need to. You probably need to. Aqua boy, aqua girl, Jesse, David. That's looking okay. Buddy mess. Eh. Okay. Oh, just six four. Very good. Doggo doggos. We could make more doggos too. We could really use more doggos. Do that. That's nice. I love doggos. Looks like we got plenty of infantry armor for now, so I'm gonna switch you guys over to rioters. And rioters. Did I say rioters? I'm in rioters. Cool. Rocket launchers. We still have plenty enough infantry equipment. Nice. HMGs. Let time go on. Get some better lock rocket launchers. Nice. Yeah, we're doing a lot better than last time. Holy cow. Uh, didn't have to waste nearly as much manpower fighting different people, especially Vault City. That was actually pretty easy because they were... They didn't have that many divisions. They were attacked I think, on two fronts when I redid this. From Actually, the Pill Folk was taking them out as well, so that was actually pretty easy. Yakuza were attacking Vault City of all places, and they still lost when I joined the war. Actually, they declared war on me, I think. I wasn't even ready to go to war with them, so... Oh well, each campaign is always a little different. Even from, if I play a campaign and then you guys try the exact same nation, or play this exact same nation, it's not going to be exactly the same. It's going to be similar, of course, but, I mean, sometimes it's just weird how things work out, or don't work out. 
Uh, if they don't work out, usually I won't show you because I don't like putting too much or too many negative things on the channel. <laughs> so, usually you'll see a good attempt. Not my like best attempt, but a good attempt of what I do. Uh, Hordes of the North, Spoils of War Caps, oh, that's okay. The boxing scene. Let's do this one. Renovating the right distillery. So the rights amass their fortune and power through the distillery and distribution of alcohol, despite their insistence. They are temperate tea totalers. Re renovating their distillery will bring more riches to Reno. Yes. Uh, Marlurks. I love their meat, so let's get rid of them. Egyptian Itza, Nueva Atsalan. Very good. And how much longer must we wait for the apostles? Just less than a month. And in the meantime, the troll warren, or the warren itself, we just got. A few thousand more manpower, just a little bit more manpower, not maybe, maybe not a few thousand, but like four more factories. And a dockyard. Wow, what do we do with a dockyard? I gotta do some naval research then. What are we doing over here? Wow, we're building stuff up, rebuilding stuff up very quickly. Go and do that. Uh, do that, that. Wow, we actually built up a lot of this stuff already. Holy cow. Obviously, I've not spent that much time trying to build up infrastructure, which is fine, you know. I wasn't really focused on it as I was trying to rush through, trying to get back to where we were at from yesterday's video, but whatever. All this will be ours eventually. Cool. Uh, go and put that on. That's fine. A couple more divisions. That's fine. Make a couple more military factories. That'd be fine. Good, good, good. Oh, there goes a nation down in Mexico that I don't really care about in this campaign. Hey, New Vegas is gone as well. There goes... The Legion in destroying Vegas. Good job, guys. Pat on the back for you guys, even though it's not that hard to take them out as long as you got some piercing power. Or I should say, really, enough piercing power. Cool, let's go ahead and go to war. I can't imagine these guys would be too tough. Uh, give it a little bit of time because we decided to train a few soldiers. Oh, hello. Hello there. Thorn Fast Fingers? I thought it was a fat thorn. I'll be like, Man, I love fat thorns. That sounds really awesome. Nerd rage, oh, that'd be good. I put you under commanding field marshal, crackpot. I love crackpot. Uh, if that's the case, I really don't want these guys destroyed. Give me three, two, good enough for me, and here we go. Murtaugh, are you guaranteed by High Chapel? They haven't been killed off yet. White legs might be worth taking out, actually. They are fighting someone, so Legion training? That's fine, whatever. They are going to expand this way, which is going to ruin their manpower if they took over my territory, because I don't really care about it that much. Ah, uh, dive bombing? Unnotable, great thing that we can use. Good. CQC training? I love it. Heavy me melee weaponry? Absolutely necessary. We've lost about 18 guys versus 1,000. Not bad. We definitely have better casualty ratios, but that's okay. HMGs? Love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Good. Glory falls, but you know what? Arago will fall as well very, very soon. And we have it. Very good. Very, very good. Thank you, Arroyo, for playing. Thank you very, very much. Now what? I guess it's White Legs time. And maybe we can try using some of these bears. Bear. Oh, maybe not. Got too many holes here. Oh, man. The crazy... Crazy horns are looking... They're looking thick. Wow. Um, infrastructure. Um, you know what? Let's get some infrastructure. So, east side rail station. Restoring the old rail station will create a hub of infrastructure and another way for thrill-seeking NCR citizens or any citizen in the wasteland to take a trip to the biggest little city in the world. Very good. Um, I might just take out the timber line. Now that opened up too many waterways between me and the Washington Brotherhood, which we will have to take out eventually. Oh, come on, White Legs. The Crazy Horns, how are they this strong? Are they allied with anybody? They're guaranteed by these guys. You are still fighting Arsel. Also are fighting those guys up there. Hmm. Hmm. Last episode, we saw the, he the heathens. Yeah, we saw this. Claims? Yeah. Go ahead and do that. Do we have war goals against the NCR, Western Brotherhood? Pretty normal stuff. Uh, I guess for you guys. Try to come down here. Bah. Thick daddies. That need air superiority to be really effective, actually. Go and do that. That'd be fine. Oh, we got plenty of support equipment. That's really beautiful to see. I love support equipment. 20 combat width. 40 combat width. 
Cool. Uh, also, this division template I made for the behemoths, this is not optimal. I have no idea what is optimal at all. Um, slashing, generic. Uh, cultural, generic. I guess we could say that one just because it makes it look cool. But yeah, that's not the optimal behemoth template. Oh, maybe it is, but I, I don't think it is. I really don't think it is. Eastside Rail, that'd be nice. Finish off. Got plenty of stability. Stability for the people. Can't imagine we have to wait too much longer, but please don't die. Ah, oh, 40 days. God dang it. If that's the case, we'll probably just go to war with Murtaugh. God dang it. Ah. Oh. Jesus. Ah. Oh, the Mormons are not looking good. Uh, yeah, they don't have much manpower. New Canaan is... Uh, God dang it. We were waiting. We were waiting. We became disappointed. Became even more disappointed. This is the best I've ever seen the Crazy Horns go crazy. Have you ever seen the Crazy Horns expand this much? I haven't. I don't even touch them. Which sounds really weird when I say it like that. Are you? Wait, are you guys? Hold on. Is the NCR fighting the Legion? Oh my gosh, this is the perfect time to fight the Legion. Or... Actually, it is probably the perfect time to fight the Legion and the NCR. Van Graaff expansion? Sure, allowing the Van Graaff family to expand their operations and energy weapon dealing would bring in even more money. In a dangerous place like New Reno, people deserve a little, uh, a protection. Good. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Ah, uh, but how... Mm, actually, how is it? Hmm. Hmm. But then we have to fight. Hmm. I want to see what happens. I hope the Legion does win a little bit more, because they're doing pretty well. My main goal would be against... Oh, shaw, shaw, macho, macho. What happened? Uh, bringing the war to the... What the heck? That will make it so easy to take them out. But why? What? I guess they demanded it from the crazy horns, but that's... That's not smart. That's really not too smart for them to do, because... I mean, I'm sure they get some sort of, uh... Oh, that's me. They have some compliance, but... They're slowly going up. By quite a bit. Hmm, that did not look good. Go and do that. Freeform close air support, thank you. Even more freeform close air support. The Day of Judgment, the capture of Lincoln. At what cost did they win? Oh, no, this is nice. This stuff is nice. Powered melee opener, just go and grab it. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't you worry about a thing. I'm not going to go to war with California yet, because they are slow. Oh, yeah. oh God, I want to go to war with the Mormons, though. We already ha oh, oh, hmm. I can't go to war with California yet, because they know I want to go to war with them. They had overrun New Reno very quickly, and I have to kill off these guys as well. They're out of manpower. These guys would be pretty easy to take out, but I just don't have the divisions for all that. If we wait for the Legion to go to war with the NCR, they might not themselves have enough manpower to garrison everything, yeah. Because they are... What, what's the score like for now? Because we have enough manpower, surprisingly, compared to yesterday. Let's see, 16,000. That's not bad. That's not... That's really good for the Legion. Holy cow. Compared to where uh, these guys are at. Oh. Med X, even better. Good. No one likes New Canaan. That's okay with me. That's totally okay with me, actually. We need to research a canoe, too. Come on. Yes. More bears. Give me the bears. Oh, yeah. Look at that. 18, 19. Oh, that's looking nice. That's looking real nice. Van Graaff expansion. Gladly take it. Silver Rush. Let's go with expanding the boxing ring. So the Jungle Gym of Reno hosts the massive boxing scene of Reno. Okay. It provides great entertainment for the masses, after all. Who doesn't want to see a man have his fun... His punch, his face, punched in. I can't speak, so I guess this would be an appropriate time for me to end the episode here. If you enjoyed today's weird episode, consider leaving maybe a like, probably not a dislike. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, consider leaving a sub or two, or maybe just one. If you haven't checked out my Discord uh, yet, uh, the link is in the description below. Regardless, I do hope you enjoyed today's episode, and I hope to see you all tomorrow in the next episode where we will go to war with a few Mormon guys and maybe some people who believe in democracy. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.